Alright. Me and John T are gonna go for a walk again down to the uh, down to the lot down below. Um, wasn't planning on doing this today, Saturday afternoon. Um, sky's pretty overcast, so it's a good good cloudy day. But that's the reason right there. Um, been going for several hours and it'll go all day and half the night. So I just gotta get away from it. Well, this place right here, this is where I get my uh, my supplies for my pigeons to feed and medicines and whatnot. Um, it's about a five minute walk-ish from the house. Uh, I was going to a place all the way up by the mall. Um, but uh, this guy has what I need and he's right here local. So, anyway... Just thought I'd share that real quick. Z-Cap Hardware. I'm pretty sure that is the place where they were getting the materials when uh, they built the duplex rentals next door to us. And I just stopped in here and got some uh, string for pulling the string line um, down at the property. Anyway... We got a little bit accomplished today. Um, found a couple more uh, property corner pins. This one right here was buried under about you know four or five inches of uh, of dirt. This one right here. I don't know how well you can see that, but anyway, there's that one, which is um, the one corner of the first lot that we actually everything's titled already. That we hadn't found yet so now we got all four corners of the first lot and uh, I haven't looked for it but probably right over in there um, is the uh, uh, the other pin for the the alleyway or the access road which that's where I'm standing right here I kind of I got a string line here um, going up to the uh, the other corner pin so this this is the access road behind our lot, and then there's more lots to my, off to my left. And so these are there's the corner one of the corner pins that we had uh, originally found that one, and that's the other side over there. My finger's in the right spot over in there. Um, is the uh, the other side of of the access road. <clears throat> now I'm talking with. The pastor next door, uh, he showed us uh, one on his property, which is right back over there in his yard. If you follow that wire, it's kind of coiled up back over there. I don't know if you can tell. It's right in line with the post of that old bed frame uh, over there. And then right here... Right where I'm standing, on that side of the fence, I don't know if you can see it, I put my boot over top of it, down there. Um, that's a pin right there, it's actually got, looks like a, a nail sticking out of it or something. Anyway, that's a uh, corner of his lot, right there. And again, this is access road, right here. And then, the... Uh, back pin should be right here. Kind of dug around. I hadn't found it yet. We did find the front one this time of this uh, second lot that we bought. I just got done digging that out. That's right down in there. Kind of dark now. I don't know how well you can see it. But it's right there at the end of my boot. Uh, and, you know, we already had the ones out front, so that gives us all four for the original lot and three for uh, the second lot that we bought. Now, what we can do is pull a string line from that pin up to the, uh, 
the pen at the pastor's house, which is just inside of his fence, um, up there, and then uh, the access road is uh, three meters wide, and so which is just a hair over ten feet. So we measure back down that line ten feet, and that will be our our property corner, which I am. 98% sure that it's right there at that uh, that post, just just this side of that post, right in front of it, right there. So basically, that post is a, the back corner of this lot. So this tree and large rock here is on our property. So that'll have to go. And uh, anyway. That is the progress that we have made today.